How y'all doing? Welcome to the next episode of Gordo's Good Eats. Today we're going to be making lemon pepper spatzcock chicken in my ugly drum smoker. And I also want to give a special shout out to two of my biggest fans. One right here, and the other one right here. Thank y'all both for supporting Gordo's Good Eats. I'm gonna set up the inside. My charcoal pan. That's hot. That side's the coals on top. I'm gonna put an old smoky baffle plate over it to prevent it from burning the chicken. After that, I'm gonna put my water pan right on top of it. Which is a turkey roaster pan, but that's what I use for a water pan. I'm gonna fill the pan with water at least halfway. So I'm done with that, I'm gonna be placing the rack inside. There it goes. Now I just gotta let it warm up before I put the chicken inside of it. I know a lot of y'all know this already, but here it goes. I'm gonna show you that using an onion will help clean your grill and also keep it from stick all the food from sticking to it. It helps real good. You gotta make sure that your grill grid is nice and hot, warmed up, and it'll pick up all the bacteria and everything that's on it and also give it a real good smell. See that? That's how it works. Okay, now I'm gonna be placing the chicken into the drum. Right in the middle. Straighten out the legs. Then where they come up and over on that backside. This is how you want your chicken to look. Spread it out nice. You can do the wing spread. You can put them behind the breast. Or you can just let them sit where they are. Alright then, right now I'm going to be spraying my chicken down with apple cider vinegar to help get some more smoke took, stuck to it and also enhance the flavor of the citrusness. And we're back after about five hours of cooking. Let's take a look at the bird now. Oh yeah, look at that beauty. She's been cooking for more than five hours at 200. 37 degrees. I just recently checked the temperature and she's about 170 degrees. Real nice. Well, it's about time for me to take her inside and cut her up. <laughs> 